Welcome to work with MCL60 Fully Auto Chemi Nominations Immunoassay System. The MCL60 Fully Auto CLIA system can support a variety of sample types, including serum, plasma, whole blood, and capillary blood. The corresponding original sample tubes can be directly loaded. Before testing, please make sure the system status is ready. Stand by or testing. To start the testing, make sure the sample is ready. Then open the sample reagent chamber cover. A window of sample loading and reagent loading will automatically pop up on the main software interface. Choose any available position and wait for the sample plate to rotate to designated position. Before loading the sample, please check the sample carefully to avoid any abnormality such as hemolysis or lipidemia. When loading the samples, the operation details may vary for different sample tubes. Serum and plasma sample tubes can be inserted directly. The barcode of the sample tube should be directed towards the outer opening of the sample position. The whole blood sample tubes need to be inverted three to five times gently and then be loaded after mixing. Be sure there is no bubbles generated during the mixing process. A micro tube is needed for capillary blood samples. Before loading, use the middle finger to flick the micro tube gently to make the capillary blood fully mixed without any air bubbles. Then use a special capillary blood vessel holder to insert the tube into the sample position. To avoid samples sedimentation, the whole blood and capillary blood samples should not exceed five samples for each loading. Close the sample reagent chamber cover after loading the sample and the MCL60 system will automatically scan the positions selected previously. Then close the reagent loading window on the software interface. Suppose the MCL60 is connected to the dual lease system. The test can be automatically operated. If not, the test needs to be conducted manually. When manual testing needed, clicking sample single selection or sample multiple selection button firstly on the sample editing interface. To choose multiple selection means multiple samples to perform the same test. Otherwise, sample single selection shall be chosen. When editing a certain test, choose the specific sample on the interface for test information editing. Then choose the corresponding test type, sample type, sample tube type, and a dilution factor as well as the desired parameters to be tested in turn. When choose the sample type as capillary blood, the sample tube type will be automatically switched to microtubes. In order to ensure the operation accuracy, it is highly recommended to check whether the edited test information is correct in the preview. After the sample editing is completed, Click the play button on the operation interface. The MCL60 system will start to test. The interface will show testing when the test is on and it will turn to standby when the test is over. During the testing process, you can view the details of each test in the real time task, including the end time of each test. The MCL60 supports continuous sample loading and novel testing can be added after the sample pipetting is completed and no need to wait the whole testing process of previous samples to be done. When the sample tray interface status displays as orange, it means the sample pipetting is completed and that the sample reagent chamber cover can be opened. Taking out the sample that has been pipetted and loading a new sample. Then repeat the above sample loading process. Novel tests can be added continuously. You can click Result menu on the main interface to check the result after testing. Thank you for watching.